There's less than three weeks left for a fresh Pacific halibut as the fisheries along the west coast from Alaska to California are set to close on December 7th. Over the next three weeks, fishermen are likely to harvest a remaining 1.3 to 3 million pounds of Pacific halibut before the season closes. In the latest catch report from mid-November, 86% of the fishery limit, or 25.6 million pounds, had already been harvested. While this year's fishery limits were 10% lower than in 2022, next year's catch limit won't be confirmed until January 26. However, we can expect a sneak peek into what it might be when the International Pacific Halibut Commission releases their stock projections and harvest decision table for the upcoming season in the forthcoming weeks. The IPHC is officially in its 100th year of managing Pacific halibut in Canada and the US. And with that, the 100th annual IPHC meeting, where the new fishery limit is announced, will be held in Anchorage, Alaska from January 22nd to the 26th, 2024 at the Hotel Captain Cook. Moving on to the marketplace, we are still seeing some of the lowest pricing on Pacific halibut since the pandemic lockdowns of 2020. On our Tradex Live Seafood Offers portal, Single and twice frozen halibut fletches can be seen around the low $13 to mid $14 range, while our last H&G Pacific halibut offer was in the low $8 range. With the halibut season soon coming to a close and not reopening until March of next year, our recommendation is that you may want to strongly consider securing inventory for your future halibut needs. Depending on market conditions and processor capabilities, frozen halibut could get put into cold storage until prices tick back up. Contact Tradex Foods for any and all of your halibut requirements. And to conclude, here are some insights on Russian Pacific halibut. While Russian halibut is predominantly caught as bycatch, detailed information about its fishery remains largely undisclosed. However, given that, halibut is not a staple in the diets of Russia or China, and considering that Chinese production largely relies on Russian halibut, a significant portion of the halibut production from both Russia and China is intended for the North American market. This market dynamic allows us to estimate the volume of Russian halibut harvest using U.S. import data. In 2021, the U.S. imported about 3.2 million pounds of halibut products from Russia and China. It's noteworthy, however, that since the onset of the war conflicts, the U.S. import of halibut from these countries have significantly decreased. Thank you for joining me for the Tradex Foods 3-Minute Market Insight. This is Robert Ryerson reminding you to buy smart and eat more seafood.